The pandemic took its toll on businesses across our region, including an indoor climbing facility in the Upper Valley, which never reopened. But developers have now broken ground on a new facility in Lebanon that has community members looking up. Adam Sullivan reports. Living in New England, we all know that the winter months can be a bear to find ways to recreate. But here in Lebanon, New Hampshire, a new climbing facility is in the works that will fill a much needed void. It may be winter, but there's a lot of construction activity on this property just off Route 120 in Lebanon. It will soon be home to a new climbing center called The Notch a nod to Franconia. Co-owner Noah Lynn grew up in the area. It had been an idea for quite some time. Lynn caught the climbing bug in Connecticut after meeting Josh Garrison. The two climbing buddies decided to move back to the area to open the facility. It's a great way to be outside. It's a great way to learn new things, um, challenge yourself physically, and also access uh, beautiful places. This rendering gives an idea of what the new climbing center will look like when completed. It will include multiple 45-foot walls, for all ability levels. It's a, a population that loves to be active and to pursue things like this, and, and so we're excited to offer it year-round. The Green Mountain Rock Climbing Center across the river in Quichi has now been closed for several years. Ever since the Quichi uh, facility closed down, there's been a lack of places within reach. That facility used to be the go-to spot for students who took part in the Wall Climbers program run by the Lebanon Recreation Arts and Parks Department. We lost an entire group of kids that we were able to program for, so having the Notch come here and right here in Lebanon is huge. We see the Notch as a, as a major community resource. A resource all year long including the region's long, cold winters. We certainly want to develop, you know, kids climbing programs, summer camps, um, and have a place that all members of the community um, can come and spend time. The developers say the construction will continue through the winter months. They hope to have the notch open to climbers by this fall. Reporting from Lebanon, New Hampshire, Adam Sullivan, Channel 3 News. The American